Well, our weather very nice out there. No problems weather-wise. Taking a live look outside. It is a clear sky out there. It's kind of cool, comfortable, especially north of the lake. Here at the South Shore, we're at 68 degrees, so it's not too cool this morning, but it is still pretty comfortable. That dew point of 45, very dry air over the area with an east wind around 6 miles per hour. You can see north of the lake, 50 right now in Bogalusa, 51 in Slidell, 54 for you in Hammond versus uh, 58 there in Homa, 53 in Bell Chase, and you're 70 down along the coastline. You'll notice those temperatures about 12, 13 degrees colder this morning from Bogalus and Slidell as some of that cold air kind of filters down the Pro River Basin there. It's about 14 degrees colder also in Bell Chase. So some spots a little bit chillier this morning, but a cool and comfortable one for sure. Warm, less humid weather continues across the area today. Another cool night tonight, but then storms return on Wednesday, and some of them could get on the strong side. Hour by hour shows the beautiful day with a lot of sunshine. Temperatures warming from the 50s and 60s there to the 70s by 11 a.m. and 74 by 1 o'clock this afternoon with more of that sunshine and some of those light winds. We'll get to about 80 on the south shore, same for Bogalusa, near 80 in Slidell, Gonzales to home about 79 degrees. Normal high is 81, so just a tad below normal for this time of year, but still very, very nice out there as we start getting the last couple of days of April. Now for tonight, another cool night, mid 50s there on the north shore, lower 60s here in the city, then upper 50s from Homa back to Belt Chase. So another pleasant one is in store for us as well. A couple of high clouds there to the north shore this morning. That's really about it. The rest of us are clear and comfortable this morning and see more of those clouds over north Louisiana, Mississippi as high pressure sits right over top of the Arklamis area. And really our weather stays quiet today. Tomorrow's that high stays right over top of our region. Now as we go forward here throughout the week, we will see our chance rate increasing to 70% there by Wednesday. And that's our next little front that's going to be moving through. But then we dry out as we head into Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and into Sunday. So things will be looking pretty good as we go beyond Wednesday. So here's how it plays out for us. High pressure remaining over the area for the day today without low humidity. And there's winds starting to come more out of the east and southeast later, later today. But still pretty much comfortable weather for us. As we go forward here throughout the rest of the day today, heading on into tonight, we are going to start to see more in the way of the southeasterly winds returning. There are some stronger storms to our north, and that's where some severe weather will break out. A possibility for tomorrow, but looks like those storms will stay up there and not impact our area. They kind of dive down toward Houston by tomorrow afternoon. Then as we head on into Tuesday night and Wednesday, we'll see another cold front moving toward us. Could see some showers and storms popping up here in the morning. And then as they continue working the way through the region here by the afternoon, here comes that cold front. Some stronger storms here possible. Mississippi there back to Alabama. May see a few of them trying to develop across our area by Wednesday afternoon. So we'll keep an eye on those as well. And then as we go on into Wednesday night, those clear out of the area. So it is possible we could see some severe weather there on Wednesday. The threat is going to remain very low as we do have a level one marginal risk for not only here in New Orleans, but all the way from much of the Gulf South area. Basically, we're talking about strong winds, maybe some large hail with some of the thunderstorms. So definitely we'll keep an eye on that as we head into that Wednesday time frame. So look for those temperatures around 80 today, 84 tomorrow, 83 with our storms on Wednesday, about a 70% chance and a lot of sunshine as we head to the end of the week and weekend. And for the first weekend of May, right on cue, those temperatures get up to that 90 degree mark.